this is it. This is the final team we're gonna be using to build up hype towards the Dragon Ball Legends sixth anniversary. Today, we're gonna hop into PvP and we're gonna be using the summonable units from the Dragon Ball Legends fifth anniversary. I'm honestly really excited to use this team because one, they pretty much all correlate with each other apart from him. But um, also these are the most modern anniversary units until, you know, the sixth anniversary begins. But either way, uh, this is the team. I'm hoping everything will turn out well. And also note, this is a themed team battle video. I'm doing this just for fun. So the goal is to win at least one battle and that's it. To reiterate, this is a themed team battle video. I'm doing this just for fun. So the goal is to win at least one battle and that's it. Anyway, let's go. So, um, again, these are the most modern anniversary units. It's gonna be, okay, it's gonna be kind of hard using him, uh, maybe her too, but, I mean, realistically speaking, these two, they're totally fine, and then, like, on top of it, like, we, we have what it takes in order to be able to survive against, like, some crazy units, so, that's good, right? Because, again, we have him, well, them, uh, where they're able to counter Rising Rush, which will be fantastic, and if they can't do it, I could throw in Piccolo, and he can just tank a rush. Speaking of which, <laughs> look at the team we're fighting. Leading off with you, you're going in, and you're absolutely going in. Uh, he's definitely going in, 100%. Yep. 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 Okay, so, all we need to do is just get around uh, Indestructible and just straight up wipe out Endurance, and I think we'll be fine. Uh, doesn't mean that this is going to be easy, but here's hoping that we can make something work. No. Kind of hope that you... Good. All right, keep it going. All right, that's fine. And bam. No. Pop main. Yes. Oh, you swapped. Live with that. All right. Dude just charged in. He did not care. I'm still locked in. Okay, not locked in anymore, but... Yeah, me being locked in for that long really messed everything up. Okay. Throw. I mean, Piccolo's taking these hits, which is good. You turning your brain off is not going to help you. But the combo still going on is going to be something else. It, it's still going. It, there's just no way. It's still going. It finally ended. All right, there we go. Holy. Yep. Send him out. Hmm. Swap. Okay. Let's just get you knocked out quick. Okay, cool. Let's go. One down. Cool. Gauge restored. Back off. Yes. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Set him up. Die. Of course, but it's element neutral. Hmm. There we go. Cool. Let's go. Uh, let's actually hold off. I don't know why you keep doing that, bro. Take a low. Cool. Okay. So far, so good. Never mind. <laughs> uh, but again, we're not down and out. So I still have Piccolo, which is fantastic. And I have a special move. We have a really good hand because it's just variety. So yeah, let's get it. Way too obvious. Okay, cool. Get some hits off. That's fine. Just get my gauge up. Oh, dude threw it out because he knew. Dude knew. Wait. Okay, let's get it. All right, there we go. Keep that going. Darn it. Yep, there it is. Mm. Follow up. Uh, this should be strong enough to wipe him out. There we go. Okay, cool. It, it's been a long while 
since I've uh, actually uh, used or uh, landed Piccolo's uh, LF. Uh, granted, I don't really use him anymore, but uh, it's been a while. I'm glad we're able to land it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Look, special beam cannon, gone. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't make the rules. I, I do not. So uh, first battle went very, very well. Again, when it comes down to the anniversary units, I expect this team to work the best, hand down, uh, hands down. But um, obviously, like, anything can happen, right? Like, we can fight against somebody who's just, like, insanely good. But uh, for the most part, though, for us uh, starting off this video, it was good, right? And like I said, it's it really just comes down to, like, the modernity of units, right? Where with the first anniversary, kind of hard to work with those units because they're just not modern at all. In comparison to the fifth anniversary, that battle went very well. But, like, these guys have modern kits. Like, kits that are, like, you know, that you would see, like, on units, like, in this day and age. Up until, you know, maybe the sixth anniversary when they add new stuff. But, yeah. All right, next battle. Oh, Goku. That's going to be annoying. Like, it's not like we don't have anything against him, but that unique gauge is going to be a problem. It absolutely will be. And realistically speaking, I can't bring in Jiren either. Because if I do, he's just going to, like, run all over him. So, uh, same team. Same team. All I really need to do is... Okay. Gohan? Well, I mean, I, I get it. I get it. That's fine. Um, I need to swap their order and make sure I can get Frieza in. Again, they, this could go either way. Because, again, they, they are modern units. But, again, these units are still uh, respectively powerful. So... We'll see what happens, but this by no means means that this will be easy whatsoever. So, we'll see what happens. Oh, we are uh, we are in here. Ooh, smart, smart. No. That was not smart. Bring him in, bro. Bring him in. Yep. Mm. It's going to do just no damage. Oh, wait, hold on. That was, that was a little bit of something. Wide open. Drop. All right, let's get it. All right, let's keep it going. Yep, should have known. Uh, let's just do this. Oh, he swapped out so quick. Launch him. Okay, so I did that just to do that. Swap. No. Saw that. Yep. Look at him. Nice and free. No fight cover change. We take that. Come on, give me another card. There we go. No fight cover change again. All right, that is okay. Back off. There we go. Yep, thought so. That's why I backed off. Okay, backing off again. Okay, wasn't expecting that. Delicious. Scrumptious. You're going to transform eventually. There it is. Okay. Because I'm like, you're, you're going to do it, bro. Just whenever you're ready. <laughs> just, just get it over with, please. Uh, Neutral, but I don't know if Frieza can actually take that. Ooh, no. There we go. This gives me an opportunity to get you out of the way. Let's just knock you out quick. There we go. Cool. One down. All right, good patience. Can't fault that. I still have Piccolo. Uh, downside is I don't have their... Um... Perfect Vanish. That's fine. Dang, that hit hard. Okay, uh, well, there's that. Uh, anyway, so, 
I don't have defensive measures anymore unless Goku and Frieza end up being last man standing, but yeah, right now, not good. Is that all you've got? That, that was too obvious, man. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Please. All right, get Vegito in. Yep, that was very obvious. All right, get you in. Okay, and sit here and wait. Are you gonna attack? No attack, okay, cool. Just build up my gauge, that's fine. Unless you rush here. Okay. No! Hot main! Hello? Nah, bro, don't do this. I'm like, bro, do not forfeit. Die. Get him out of the way. And goodbye. Okay, one down. Vegito? Cool. Alright, just get Frieza in there. Because, <laughs> like, I'm like, Vegito's not going to be dealing the damage. Like, oh, they forfeited. Okay. I don't know why, though, because they had Indestructible. If I recall correctly, I never activated it. So, uh, there's that. But we, we take that. Yeah, but um, anyway, that was uh, that was a fun battle all around, though, honestly speaking. But uh, yeah, it really came to just being able to get around Goku and Bardock, right? Because of the indestructible mechanic, obviously it made things relatively difficult. But even though they were last man standing, we still had like the necessary units to kind of keep them at bay. I would have tried to use my ultimate tank with uh, Vegito Blue, but obviously with Goku being in, not the best idea, right? Anyway, final battle. Uh... This should be relatively straightforward. I kind of want to bring Kyoe in, honestly. I... Mm. Nah, let, let me not... Let me not be foolish. Okay, let's... Yeah, let's do this. Like, I wanted to bring in Kyoe. I, I think this would have been a good opportunity to bring, uh, bring her in, but... Again, just... Anything can happen. I don't want to put her in a predicament where, like, she's just going to get annihilated. Like, the first Vanish would be nice, and then uh, using, like, her special skills and whatnot, but... Hmm. I don't know. Like, I want to be able to wipe out this team because this should be a team we should be able to wipe out with uh, little to no effort on paper. I thought he was transformed, but that's fine. Because he gave me that. Bring him in. Bring him in. There you go. One, two, and three! Ah. Uh, that's fine with me. Just wide open. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. I was barely off on key. Alright, back off. No. No. Bro, what? Cool. Alright, let's get it. Pop this. All the key blast. Up. Cool. And throw. Vegito. Yeah, this dude is rotating. Oh my goodness. Back off, not worth it. Cool. Yep, thought so. Come over. That's about it. Repent for your sins. Nope. Okay, now we gotta take some hits, which is not good. Ooh. Oh, you dropped it? I didn't even realize. I'll have Vegito take that. Uh, because Vegito should be able to take this hit. The main thing is I gotta wipe somebody out. That's really it. We haven't gotten to that point yet because uh, dude is constantly like rotating to stay like, you know, ahead. There we go. Cool. Let's try to stay one step ahead. Yep. Pop this. 
Hmm. All right. Yep. Okay. And no key. And no cards. Best case scenario, right? Uh, here we go. No. Send him out. Follow up. And die! There we go. Alright, because nobody can cover change for you now. Rush. Don't care who I hit. Cool. I did not care who I hit. I need somebody gone, right? The moment we wipe out at least one person. Okay, good. Uh, we wipe out one person that disrupts the entire flow of the team. So, now that one of them is gone, one Vegito is safe. Well, safe-ish in comparison to how he was, you know, before. But also, now we can actually apply pressure to the opponent. So, there's that. He just charged in. He did not care. <laughs> Dude did not care. Alright, let's get it. Scrumptious. No. You have to pop your main just to live. Cool. We take that. <laughs> That's fine. I'll wait. Oh, I did that way too late. That's fine. Woo, but we take that, though. And there's that. Okay, so I did have slow reaction time when I threw out the ultimate attack, but... Uh, we still ended up winning, right? Again, the main thing with that team was that they were able to constantly rotate, right? Because I didn't, if I recall correctly, I didn't read off with, uh, lead off with, like, the right unit. So, because of that, it made it hard to, like, you know, stay ahead of the opponent. But we still made it work, right? And like I said, when it came down to the 5th anniversary units, I expected them to have a better result than literally any of the other anniversary units. Just because these units are not even a year old yet. Especially him. And also, he got updated, too, with uh, the unique equipment as well. So, either way, though, it, somehow we managed to make it work. But now all that's left is the sixth anniversary. Again, we don't know what's in store for all of us, but I'm excited to find out on the 25th. But, uh, well, it's 25th for... You guys know what I mean. Either way, though, I do want to know in the comment section below, are you guys willing to try out the fifth anniversary units before the sixth anniversary? Again, let me know in the comment section below. But with that being said, I'm Inakuba, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.